In this case, a coworker has created a procurement agent and our IT team has approved it and made it available in our company's agent store. Now as a procurement manager, I can find the agent and also set it up with just a couple of clicks. Then once it's up and running, it contacts me in Teams and asks what I'd like it to do and which tasks to perform. As a procurement agent, it recommends that I give it supplier policies, approved supplier lists, and a procurement playbook. So I'll do that here with my team's policy guidelines and just type, use this policy guide for your actions, and then forward slash reference my Zava procurement file. Now the agent has what it needs to start working. For interoperability with me, other people, and other agents, it has its own suite of Microsoft 365 apps and a unique account to work on its own. In fact, as an order request comes in from a customer for new laptops, the agent reasons over that request using the instructions I provided, and it can also use contextual business information across Microsoft 365 with WorkIQ to find these suppliers, their SLAs, pricing from recent orders, and related documents. Based on the fulfillment time, it even recommends a supplier and asks me if it should proceed. Once I confirm, it creates the purchase order for the laptops and logs that into our purchasing tracker Excel spreadsheet in SharePoint. And right from the comments, like I would at mention any coworker, here I've at mentioned the procurement agent for status updates.